Hello again Clarence superfans, Clarence had beaten Quaylag and was escaping Blight Town. Almost. But upon returning to Firelink Shrine, something was very wrong. He could not light the fire anymore. What? But now, we have a new problem. It's noisy, it snores, and its breath is lethal. This is no laughing matter, I tell you. A strange creature was discovered. Oh, what the fuck is that? Exclaimed Clarence. There you go. Oh, shit. Farewell. Well, you must be a new arrival. I'm Andre of Astora. If you require... Clarence met a Viking called Andre, and narrowly avoided being electrocuted. The opening of the gate, brought on by ringing the second bell of awakening, had introduced Clarence to a lot of new creatures. All wanted to kill him. Electric rock monsters. Crystal titan monsters. Hydras. Snake men and snake wizards. Bushes. And even the chests. Haha, ha, look at this damas. It seemed, Clarence's only friend here, was the balls. Oh heavens, thank you, I'm saying. Surprise drone strike. Anyone would think, this place was a third world country, with the amount of bombs being dropped. Oh boy, another fighter. Clarence and Iron Tarkus, Team Super Tank set out to defeat the Iron Golem who was guarding a crappy broken bridge. Iron Tarkus tanked the Golem whilst Clarence provided emotional support, and the occasional jabs to the ankles. Finally, Clarence and Iron Tarkus were victorious. Upon inspecting the Golem's glowing ring, Clarence was ambushed by some bat demons, who whisked him into the heavens. What a lovely place, thought Clarence. Nice sunset, nice architecture, nice bat demons. Clarence believed that everyone here would welcome his arrival. Hello, friend. Are you friendly? Oh, 